हरे कृष्णा ओम ज्ञान तिमरंद ज्ञानंजन शलाकया चक्षुरुमृतम ये नस्म श्री गुरव नम गुरव गौरचंद्राय राधिकाय सदाल कृष्णा कृष्ण भक्ताय तदभक्ताय नमो नम संसार दुख जलद से पति काम क्रोधादीन क्रम कवले दुर्वासन से निगृत से निराशय से चेतन्य चंद्रम देही पदावल चेतन्य चंद्रम देही पदावल आनंद लीलामय विग्रहाय हिमा दिव्य छवि सुंदराय तस्म महाप्रेम रस प्रदा चेतन्य चंद्राय नमो नमस्ते हे कृष्ण करुणा सिंधु दीन बंधु जगत पते गोपेश गोपीकांत राधाकांत नमस्तुते तप्त कांचन गौरांगी राधे वृंदवनेश्वरी वृषभानुसुते देवी प्रणमा हरि प्रिय नमो भक्ति विनोदाय सच्चिदनंद नाम ने गौर शक्ति स्वरूपाय रूपानुगवरायते वृंदाय तुलसी देवी प्रियाय केशव सच कृष्ण भक्ति प्रदे देवी सत्यवते नमो नम <coughs> श्री कृष्ण चैतन्य प्रभु नित्यानंद श्री अद्वैत गदाधर शिवासादि गौर भक्त वृंद हरे कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे हरे <coughs> श्री भजन रहस्य बाय श्री भक्तिनो ठाकुर शिल भक्तिनो ठाकुर की जाए हो कमिंग बैक टू अवर श्री भजन रहस्य बाय शिल भक्तिनो ठाकुर टेक्स टू वी वर हेरिंग अगद अमन यशोदा नंदन नंद सुनो हो कमल नयन गोपी चंद्र वृंदावन इंद्र परनत करुणा कृष्ण इति अनेक स्वरूपे तय मम रते उच्चेर वर्धताम नाम धे वी वर हेरिंग दिस वर्स एंड बिकॉज देर वॉज टू डेज गैप वी सेलिब्रेटेड इन अ फॉर्म ऑफ हरी कथा द अपीरेंस एंड डिसअपेरेंस ऑफ अवर आचार्य सो द ट्रांसलेशन इज ओ नाम भगवान पोजेसर ऑफ इनकन्सिवेबल ग्लोरीज मे माई अफेक्शन फॉर यू कंटिन्यूज टू इंक्रीज डे एंड नाइट ओ अगधमन ओ यशोदानंदन ओ नंद सुनो ओ कमल नयन ओ गोपी चंद्र <coughs> ओ वृंदावनेन्द्र ओ परनत करुण ओ कृष्णा यू हैव इनमेबल फॉर्म्स मे माई अटैचमेंट टू देम ऑलवेज इंक्रीज दिस इज द मीनिंग ऑफ द वर्स नाउ भजन रहस्य वृत्ति लेट अस हियर द परपट ऑफ दिस ट्रांसलेशन ऑफ दिस वर्स अगेन द वर्स इज अगद मन यशोदा नंदनो नंद सुनो कमल नयन गोपी चंद वृंदावन इंद्र प्रणत करुण कृष्ण इति अनेक स्वरूपे तय मम रतिर उच्चे वर्धता नाम दे सो the purport is as the rupanuga sadaka chants the holy name under the guidance of pure devotees he prays to nam prabhu in great distress o nam prabhu please manifest in my heart 
along with your pastimes that relate to each name. <clears throat> so the focus here is <clears throat> right in the beginning, Srila Bhakti Tagore is teaching us as the Raganuga Sadakas chants the holy name. So we heard prior to this those who are <clears throat> chanting the secondary names what is the result of that if you remember atma ram atma kam these are secondary names those who chant what they get in return bhukti and mukti sense enjoyment and liberation those who chant holy name <clears throat> even though it's primary names but those primary names are <clears throat> in a mood of opulence the results of that is totally different from those who chant secondary names <clears throat> but those who chant in the mood of in madhure bhav in sweetness they are known as raganuga sadakas <clears throat> Ragatmika Anusmritya Sacha Raganuga Uchati. Following the footsteps of Ragatmik Jans means the associates, the Vishud Sattva Mais, the Bhakti or the footsteps, following the footsteps is called Raganuga Bhakti. And practitioners <coughs> of that Raganuga Bhakti are known as Raganuga Sadakas. So there, chanting of names their prospect of the names of krishna uh, is totally different from those who are chanting in the mood of opulence <clears throat> even though it's primary names <clears throat> so as raganuga sadhakas chants the holy name under the guidance of pure devotees they pray to Nam Prabhu in great distress. Oh, even Raganuga Sadhakas also in distress. Yes. This is not an ordinary distress. The distress of getting disrobed in the assembly as Draupadi. Distress is not how Gajendra elephant drowning in the water that's different distress there are many kind of distresses right i'm not getting good job i'm not getting good salary etc etc but here the distress is in a totally different shape <clears throat> those who are swimming practicing swimming in this realm of bhakti and tasting the flavors of bhakti yeah. in their daily practices in their daily experiences in their daily daily realizations yeah. they're tasting that flavor of bhakti and their distress is <clears throat> why i'm not able to uh, i'm not qualified or eligible enough to please krishna at the most why it is so but this is this distress is not with any scarcity this distress is not <clears throat> yeah, any kind of scarcity those who are complete they are exhibiting distress even the parikars the associates of krishna in golok vrindavan also distress because they always feel some uh, some limitations that we are not able to please krishna that realm where Krishna is the center of everything and everyone strives to 
only and only and only please Krishna in all respects even if it is a complaining mood of the motherly gopis coming to Yashoda Maya that today Kanaya broke my pot today Kanaya untied my calf today Kanaya did that ah, everyone coming with their own distress means their own excuses because they are not satisfied they want to please Krishna more and more this is the source of their distress imagine the distress which we go through in this material world and for this distress we pray to Shri Gurudev every day in the morning <clears throat> How many of us we chant this Guru Vandana prayers in the morning? Self judgment. There's no need to correct anyone. But self judgment. Shimad Guru Samsara Dava Navani Daloka Taranaya Karunya Gana Ganate Praptasya Kalyana Gunarona Vasya Vande Guru Shi Charanar Vindam. And in the last Shimad Guru Ashtaka Meta Yuche Brahme Mohurte Patati Prayatna Yastena Vrinda Vananath Sakshad Sevaya Labhya Jano Chukriteja Vande Guru Shi Charanara Vindam 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 so don't we believe the words of Vishnu Chakra Thakur is he telling lies the composer of this uh, samsara prayers means Guru Vandana after describing the glories in so many verses <clears throat> he concluded and giving a benediction, one Ashirva, the blessings. Shimad Guru Ashtakam Yena Uchi Brahme Mohurte Patiti Patayantam. Anyone who recite this Guru Ashtakam loudly in Brahm Murata, Yostena Vrinda Vana Natha Saksha, very easily he can get Sakshatkar Darshan. Proximity with Krishna. Where is the doubt if Vishnu Chakur Thakur is giving a benediction and giving this boon? Where is the doubt? <coughs> this is his benediction. So, as I told <coughs> earlier, <coughs> every disciple <coughs> supposed to recite this in the morning if possible Brahmurata but if not possible according to time place circumstance then some other time <clears throat> it can also be because when we sing this we always sing in the morning melody that's a Raga Bhairo uh, Samsara Dava Navani Daloka Tranaya karunya gana ganatva. This is morning. <clears throat> but evening also. Uh, that moment is also known as Brahmurata, the conjunction of day and night. <clears throat> we can also sing with different melody. Rag Milan. Vande Guru Shi Charana Ravinda. No, this is morning. <coughs> In the evening, Vande Guru Shi Charana Ravinda. Vande Guru Shi Charana Ravinda. Samsara Dava Navani Daloka. Ranaya Karunya Gana Ganatma. Praptasya Kalyana Gunana Vasya. Vande Guru Shi Charanara Vindam Mahaprabhu Kirtanya Nitha Gita Vadita Madhyan Manusura Sena 
रोमांचो काम पाशो तरंग भाजो वंदे गुरु श्री चरणारविंदम वंदे गुरु श्री चरणारविंदम वंदे गुरु श्री चरणारविंदम वेर इज द डाउट वेर विष्णु चक्र ठाकुर इज गिविंग दिस पेनेडिक्शन इन द एंड ऑफ वाइल रैपिंग अप द कंप्लीट गुरु अष्टकम ही गिव दिस पेनेडिक्शन so this is the distress of ragatmika jans that i am not able to please krishna as i am supposed to so following the footsteps <coughs> raganuga sadakas also they chant the holy name under the guidance of pure devotees so and they pray to nam prabhu in great distress O Nam Prabhu, please manifest in my heart, along with your past times that relate to, that relate to each name. <clears throat> you have so many names, <clears throat> and all these names are related to one of your past time. So please, this is called prayers while chanting Hari Nam, not mechanical, but with the prayers from the heart. So these are the prayers. Oh, Nam Prabhu, please manifest in my heart. Pracho Deyat, Pracho Deyat, please manifest in a very special, merciful form, so that I am able to remember your past times, those past times which are related to your names. So what is the names here? <clears throat> Agadaman. Very first name is Agadaman. Agadaman means one who killed Agasur. He who protected his friends by killing the demon Aga. <clears throat> Agasur is Aga. Bakasur is Baka. <clears throat> like a short form. Instead of reciting the complete Agasur, Bakasur, Vyomasur, uh, the short form is Aga, Baka, Vyoma. Uh, Keshi, all these asuras. So he who protect his friends by killing the demon, Agha. This is the meaning of Agasur. So Agadaman. Daman means one who kills. Kills who? Agha, the snake, Agasur. The word Agha means. Okay, now we understand. But now we are trying to understand the details, <clears throat> the explanation of the name of Krishna, Agadaman. Many brahmacharis have this name, initiated ones. Agadaman Prabhu. This is the name of Krishna, Agadaman. What is the details of the meanings? The word Aga means sins. And Daman means to destroy. He destroys the sins in the heart of a sadhaka, making it pure, and then he himself comes to reside there. How Krishna is uh, acting and how Krishna is moving. He Krishna destroys the sins in the heart of the sadhaka, making it pure, and then he himself comes to reside there. <clears throat> He wants to come and reside there. But while chanting, the mind is not with the heart or with the mind. Absence of mind and heartless, emotionless. And that's the reason Krishna is not able to come and reside there. But he himself wants to come. So when we chant the name, O oh, Agadaman, there should be the, the mood should be like this. One, Aga means not only the killer of the snake, Agasur, but Aga means also sins. One who kill, one who destroy the sins in the heart to make his residence in the heart. I was just speaking in Hindi class just before a few minutes. Who is situated in the heart? Paramatma. 
एविडेंस फ्रॉम भगवत गीता ईश्वर सर्वभूता नाम हृदय अर्जुन तिष्ट थी कृष्ण साइड आई रिजाइड इन द हार्ट ऑफ एवरी वन बट हाउ ही इज रिजाइडिंग द हार्ट ऑफ एवरी वन एस परमात्मा बट द पॉइंट हेयर इज इस परमात्मा एक्टिव एक्टिवली फंक्शनिंग इन द हार्ट द आंसर इज नो परमात्मा इज ओनली विटनेस इन द हार्ट Paramatma is not performing the killing of demons, the pastimes of killing of demons. Par Paramatma is not performing the pastimes of dancing with the gopis, etc. So, in other words, there is no reciprocation. Paramatma is just witnessing. Shiro Daksha Vishnu, uh, witnessing our activities. Then Garbha Daksha Vishnu, witness of one universe activities then karun daksha vishnu witness of the multiple universes three of them purush avatars they are acting as witness so paramatma is acting as witness is not reciprocation reciprocating and is situated in everyone's heart and just counting the karmas the activities <clears throat> but who is situated in the heart of the devotees is paramatma no who is situated ah, radha krishna pranamo yugala kisho jivane marane gati ar nahi mo once who spran one whose life is radha krishna ah Uh, the devotees make the appearance of radha krishna which devotees <coughs> not very bhaktas the raganuga bhaktas they with their uh, prema bhakti they make the appearance of their worshipable shri radha krishna in the heart just like hanuman who is worshipable of hanuman sita ram so when hanuman pierces his chest but he what everyone saw he is not not everyone saw paramatma there what they saw sita ram so paramatma is situated in everyone's heart but radha krishna comes and sit in the heart of raganuga sadaka <coughs> that's the theory and that's why <coughs> the third verse of chatur shloki bhagavatam yatha mahanti bhutani bhute chuche shanu parvishtyani parvishtyani tatha tesham na tesham what is the meaning everyone learn this verse i mean everyone learn this verse just like five elements earth water fire ether etc <clears throat> just like five elements they are present and they are situated in every individual body but they also have their own existence this earth there is water there is fire the sky ether etc they have their own existence but a portion a part a partial or a portion of them Uh, is situated in everyone's we are made of that five elements but they have their own existence by saying this verse to brahma ji what krishna wanted to say is uh, with this example of five elements yatha manti bhutani vuti chuche shanu that i situate as a par portion in the heart of every individual but i have my own eternal existence separate from uh, one who is situated in the heart separate from them therefore i come and reside where tomar hriday sada govind vishram 
और गोविंद कहे न मम वैष्णव प्राण तुम्हार हृदय सदा गोविंद विश्राम इन द हार्ट ऑफ वैष्णव इन द हार्ट ऑफ योर डिवोटीज वेर कृष्ण कम एंड नॉट ओनली रिजाइड ही गेट कंप्लीट रेस्ट देयर साधु हृदय मयम साधु हृदय तम हम मन अनत्य न जानती ना हम तेभ्यो मन गपी कृष्ण इज एड्रेसिंग कृष्ण स्पीक नो दुर्वासा सेइंग ओ दुर्वासा साधु हृदय मयम साधु हृदय तम हम आई रिजाइड इन द हार्ट ऑफ साधुस एंड साधु रिजाइड्स इन माय हार्ट आई डोंट नो एनीबॉडी एक्सेप्ट माय साधुस एंड साधुस दे डोंट नो एनीबॉडी एक्सेप्ट मी वी हैव सच स्वीट ए interaction and reciprocation <clears throat> not only i reside i make myself mind in the heart of sadhus my nirbandh hridaya uh, you see the word my nirbandh hridaya sadhu samadarshinam vashe kurvanti mad bhaktaya sat patni sat pati yatha just like a chaste wife she binds with her loving services her chaste husband Krishna say in the same way, my devotees are chaste, and they bind me in their heart. Me, not Paramatma, me as Krishna in their heart. <clears throat> That's the tattva. That's the siddhanta here. They bind me, and what is what is that in their hands by which they bind me? Rope. What kind of rope? प्रणेन रसेना दितांग्री पद्मा सभगवती भागवत उत्तमा द प्योर डिवोटीज द उत्तम भागवत दे बाइंड मी विद द रोप ऑफ देयर लव दिस इज द रोप वेयर दिस इज द रोप व्हिच कैन नॉट बी सीन दिस इज द रोप व्हिच कैन नॉट बी सीन द ऑर्डिनरी रोप व्हिच वी गेट इन मार्केट वी कैन सी दैट टचेबल बट दिस रोप Pranena rasena, the rope of love, cannot be seen. Uh, it can only be feel and realize. So pure devotees they bind Krishna with their surrender mood, and in a distress, uh, feeling unsatisfied, <coughs> they chant the name. They chant the name. O Agadaman. He who protects his friends by killing the demon Agha, this is one meaning, Agha Sur, and he destroys the sins in the heart of the sadhaka, making it pure, and then he himself comes to reside there. This is another meaning of <coughs> Agha Daman. In relation to Madhureras, oh, you see now the commentary of Akshay Thakur. In relation to Madhuri Ras, how this word is ap applicable, Agadaman? How implied? How are we going to imply this word according to Madhuri Ras perspective? Agadaman has another meaning. He whose darshans destroys the gopi's feelings of separation and thus bestow great joy upon them. You see, this is from the perspective of Madhuri Ras. <clears throat> from the Shant Ras perspective, ordinary terms. Oh, I have so many sins. Krishna, please come. Aga Daman. Aga means sins. You come and kill those sins and come and sit in my heart. Yeah. From the Sakhi Ras perspective, Oh Krishna, you are the one who killed the. Agasur, and save our life. Now, from Madhuri Ras perspective, is another meaning. He whose darshans destroys the gopi's feeling of separation, and thus bestow great, great joy upon them. <clears throat> it's so. Contradictory. <clears throat> Our Acharya is explaining. We are not supposed to. Excuse me. 
<clears throat> this one, this what happens when there is four classes in one day <laughs> in the English and then house program and then some other <clears throat> community sitting and classes <clears throat> anyway that's good so what I was saying <clears throat> from the Madhvaredas perspective yeah I was saying we are told by our charis, Krishna is not our Pariyojan, our goal. What is our goal? Prem Pariyojan. You see? Krishna Prem is our Pariyojan. The loving service of Krishna is our goal. Krishna is not the goal. But gopis, they already have that loving service that frame for Krishna and their distress of what to see Krishna for them Krishna is Pariyojan Krishna is their goal because even if Krishna is not in the proximity they are always and all times they are serving Krishna Govinda Dhamu Dharma Dhaveti Govinda Dhamu Dharma Dhaveti He Krishna He Yal Dhav He Sakheti Govinda Dhamu Dharma Dhaveti Wherever they are, whatever household activities they are doing, <coughs> they are serving Krishna, remembering the name of Krishna. Or whatever activities are done in Golok, in Gokul, is all service to Krishna. So service is already there, but something absent is <clears throat> they not have access to Krishna 24 hours. <clears throat> That's why in the distress they call Agadaman. Huh, Agadaman means, oh Krishna. Hmm. There is one asura, one demon which is entering in our heart. Please kill that demon. Krishna asks, what demon you mean? The demon of separation from you. The demon of separation. Kill that demon. And bestow your darshan. Uh, that means that darshan is great joy for us that's our festival about during the day Shri Krishna goes to the forest causing the Braj Sundaris means the gopis to burn in the fire of separation from him during the night when he is in the midst when he is in their midst he make their burning separation go far away and he appears as a pleasant as the cool moon as he sports in the pastimes of Rasa with them. Thus, he tastes Madhure Premaras. Even though full moon, even though soothing breeze from river Jamuna, but gopis are feeling. Uh, the fire of separation, which moon is not even able to subside that. The cool breeze from Jamuna is not able to subside that. Because that fire of separation, that fire is for fire for Krishna. And only he can come and extinguish that fire. There is no other way out. So amazing and appealing. Even though they are together and they are discussing the pastimes of Krishna. Even though they are together and <clears throat> discussing the flute song of Krishna, Venu Geet. Even though they are together and singing Yukal Geet. Even though they are together and singing Gopi Geet. Even though they are together singing Pranay Geet. All these Geets, 
No one is singing individually. They all collectively together singing this. And in all these songs, in all this Geet, what is there? The glories of Krishna, the remembrance of Krishna, the names of Krishna. But then more and more they are singing, more and more the fire of separation is uh, enhancing. More and more. And full moon, the rays of full moon is not enough to give sooth, soothing to them. The cool breeze from Jamuna is not enough. Because they are longing for one thing. They are longing for Krishna to be with them. Who is residing in their heart? Paramatma. Gopi Da Singh Kurushetra. Nahi Gopi Yogeshwar. Pad Kamala Tamar. Chitya Paide Santosh. Tumar Vakya Paripati. Tar Madde Kuti Nati. Suni Gopi Arabado Rosh. Don't try to cheat us with your uh, speech, with your words, that gopis, I am situated in everyone's heart, yogis meditate on me, and they are self-satisfied. So why don't you also meditate in your heart? I am there. You can also find me there. But the gopis, surpassing on Krishna, in a mood of chastising Krishna, say, Nahi Gopi Yogeshwar. Krishna, you don't even know what to speak and where to speak. Sthana sthana, na koro vichar. You have no consideration what to speak and where to speak and to whom to speak. They are little angry. Suni Gopi ar bado rosh. They become a little angry and upset. What are you saying? After long years of separation, we met together in Kurukshetra and you giving us this uh, solace with the words, not about meeting, but you're giving us philosophy that I'm situated in everyone's heart. So gopis, you all can also find me. I'm situated in your heart. Why you're not satisfied? What is that which making you unpleasant about? What is that? Then the gopi said, Nahi gopi yogeshwar. Krishna, you are yogeshwar. Ah. <clears throat> Where is the proof? That Krishna is addressed as yogeshwar. The proof is, the evidence is, the reference is, the end of Ras Leela. Around the end of Ras Lila, Shishukde Goswami is saying, Ras Ussav Sampravarto Gopi Mandal Mandita Yogeshvare Na Krishna Tase Madde Dui Dui. Krishna started the festival of Ras Lila with his gopis. Krishna, who is Yogeshwarin, the master of the yogis. But at Kurushetra, the meeting of the, the gopis, gopis are saying, Oh, don't. <clears throat> Nahi Gopi Yogeshwar Pada Kamalatwar Chitte Paibe Santosh Tomar Vake Paripati Tar Madde Kuti Nati Suni Gopi Ar Bodo Rosh. Your words are twisting words, it's not straight, it's bent words. And you giving us, making us more upset by saying this. We are not yogis. Just satisfied to keep you in the heart. You see that the focus of my point here is hmm. Krishna is not our pariyojan, aim and object. Krishna Prem means the loving service of Krishna is our object, our aim. Right? But with the gopis, they already have loving services and prem for Krishna. Premeva Goparamanam Kamnyati Agumat Pratam Iti Uddhavado Vanchanti Bhagavat Priya. Seeing this Prem, even Uddhav and other personalities, they are longing and hankering to get the same kind of love. For that kind of love, Shiva become Gopeshwar. 
to attain that dust from the lotus feet of radharani brahma ji has become mountain so someone is becoming mountain someone is becoming a blade of grass uddhav ji asam oho charan renu jusham yam syam vrindavane kim gulm api lot lata ashid nam one herb one uh, one lata one creeper or one blade of grass so uddhav ji want to become blade of grass brahma ji want to become mountain and shiva gopeshwar and naraji he want to become naradi gopi that's the glory of this they already have prem they already have loving service what are your distress about their distress is krishna is not in our proximity so in their case krishna is priyojan and in our case krishna prem is priyojan you see you understand it's a deep point they have proximity with krishna huh. they they are together and they are discussing about krishna they are singing about krishna govind damodar madaveti ya donya vani lepane while milking cows while making um, smearing cow dung everywhere by making cow dung patties taking care of the children taking care of their husband and every time they are singing uch sware with loud voice govind damodar madaveti huh. and all their activities centered towards serving krishna and they collectively together singing and chanting about krishna so that is that is already there but what they want is the proximity with krishna they are not satisfied just with that so for them for them krishna is the priyojan for us krishna prem is priyojan krishna goes to forest causing the gopis to burn in the fire of separation from him and gopis meditating on the lotus feet of krishna why you are troubling us krishna prem madhuri atiti an bhavan ani kananam why you troubling us so much <coughs> why you troubling us so much you go to the forest without wearing any slippers any shoes you troubling us if krishna asks what is the trouble i am not saying anything i am going to forest what is your problem what is the matter what is your matter what is the distress about gopi said so much distress there are so many thorns there are so many pebbles sharp edge stones in forest oh beloved sham sundar when you walking on that path of braj when you walking on that forest you are not aware what's happening in our heart prem madhuri we are scared to put your lotus feet on our breast on our chest <clears throat> the chest which is so soft and we feel so fear and scared to put your lotus feet on our chest with this mood that maybe you get hurt imagine what gopis having idea of how tender and soft the lotus feet of krishna is they are scared to put on the on their chest and with the same lotus feet you are walking on the path of forest we are there so many sharp edge stones and thorns and pebbles and so many weeds are there so what is the source of the meditation krishna remembrance so they are also doing shravanam kirtanam smaranam <laughs> gopis are also doing shravanam they are hearing each other ah distress that's the shravanam kirtanam 
they are singing the glories of Krishna. <coughs> the Gopi Geet is what? Singing the glories of Krishna. Jai Tite Dikam Jan Manavraja. Pranat Kamadam. All these verses, how much we say? So, <coughs> this is Prem Madhuri. So, Shravan is there, Kirtan is there, and Smaran is there. That's why in Raghunuga Bhakti, these three are important. Shavanam, Kirtanam, Smaranam. Yeah, Smaranam. Because gopis are also doing this. Krishna goes to forest. Enhancing that mood of Vipralam, separation mood in the heart of the gopis. Because then it will be, then it's going to be, and going to be uh, more taste and flavor in union. Pina vipralambena sambhog pushti ashim. That separation mode is to enhance. Krishna can always and always be with gopis, but no. Krishna can always be the mother Yashoda, but no. Krishna can always be with Sakhas. But not, not happening. Krishna can always be the cows. But it's not the case. Uh, Krishna, when he expands himself through 100 million gopis, why can't he expand himself? And in one, one Krishna with the sakhas playing, dancing, jumping, one Krishna can be with Mother Yashoda and motherly gopis, one Krishna can be with the cows, Gopal, one Krishna can be with the gopis to make everyone satisfied, to make everyone feel that union. But if he does that, the question is, can he do this or not? Krishna, Krishna, you cannot give excuse because you expanded yourself in so many million forms. Hundred million gopis, Shad Koti Gopi, and Krishna is reciprocating with each and every one. Ras Ustav Sampravartu Gopi Mandal Mandita Yogeshwarena Krishna Dasa Mandedu Anganam Anganam Antra Madhavam Madhva Madhavcha Antra Anganam Shibil Mangal Thakur giving commentary on this Dui Dui Gopi Ek Ek Madhav <coughs> Two Gopis and one Madhav Then two Gopis one Madhav Anganam Anganam Antra Madhavam Madhva Madhavcha Antra Anganam If you can do, if you can expand yourself in that many forms, <clears throat> if you can teach lesson to Brahmaji <clears throat> and can manifest so many Narayan forms uh, for many purposes, why can't you be with each and every rasa of devotees to accept their loving services with dasiras? Sakkiras, Vasaliras, and then Maduras. Why can't you? For you it's not difficult. But why it is why it is so? <clears throat> because to enhance that vipralambha, the mood of separation. Because that separation mood will give more flavor in meeting. That nourish the meeting. So love have two phases, vipralam and sambhog, union and separation. So many details, so much tattva and so much siddhanta is there. Uh, so Krishna goes to forest, causing the braj gopis to burn in the fire of separation from him. Krishna is causing this. And in that separation, they are meeting Krishna more than when they are in meeting with Krishna. This is called meeting in separation and separation in meeting. 
<coughs> meeting in separation when there is separation there is meeting the best example is prem sarovar where radharani is lying down next to krishna on the lap of krishna and one bumble bee came wandering here and there humming around getting bewildered seeing that lotus feet of radharani is like a the feet of radharani is like a lotus bumble bee came to touch that to extract nectar but madhu mangal came with a stick and chased that bumble bee away and said madhu sudan has gone madhu sudan madhu means honey and sudan means one who extract honey or nectar from the flowers is gone radharani just next to with krishna hearing this madhu sudan has gone krishna has gone what were her what was her mood what was her situation meeting is there but in that meeting being close to krishna she started feeling separation running here and there in all directions krishna 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 he embracing tamal tree uh, everything stimulating you know, for krishna love everything clouds peacock tamal tree etc <clears throat> this is a siddhanta that uh, separation in that meeting because after this separation this separation itself will create uh, more meeting seeing krishna everywhere jaha jaha netra pode taha krishna spure she is seeing krishna everywhere 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 in tree in clouds in peacock and extract everywhere see the intensity and during the night when he is in in their midst in the middle of the gopis he make their burning separation go far away and he appears as pleasant as the cool moon as is sports in the past times of ras with them he taste he stays madhure premaras <clears throat> yeah in the night in the middle of the gopis in the meeting then is uh, is appearing as pleasant as cool moon and is performing past times <clears throat> now union in the day time separation in the night time the union that separation was there to nourish this night meeting a night union where krishna had sported past times with radharani <coughs> with braj gopis and that's why his name is radha raman one who raman had sported past times with radharani gaur premanande हरी हरी बोल बोलो श्री राधा रमन लाल की जय श्री भजन रहस्य की जय शिल भक्ति नो ठाकुर की जय निताय गौर प्रेमानंदे हरी हरी ओम वन अनाउंसमेंट फॉर टुमोरो टुमोरो संडे वी हैव अर्ली आफ्टरनून प्रोग्राम हाउस प्रोग्राम सो दे वोंट बी english class tomorrow at this time <clears throat> but when we will be in the program there then we can put on live so you can follow uh, the session <clears throat> on facebook uh, online and that going to be around 4 pm new york time yeah just say um after 2 hours of this time everyone watching <clears throat> the live class just immediately after 2 hours so i understand it's little 
hard for all the OTs because you are in a different time zones. So if you're not able to connect, there will be a recording in the, on the Facebook itself and later you can follow up that. So that's the announcement for tomorrow. The class won't be in the same time. It will be it going to be after two hours. But of course there will be live class. Hare Krishna, Gaur Premanandi, Hari Hari Bol, Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Rama, Hare Rama, Rama Rama, Hare Hare.